All right, we're back with little Yoshi. Is the puppy's name? Unless I think of something else. But yeah, hopefully Shay doesn't go from running his mouth. Anyway, so it's where you want to start. And if you said people go wrong the first day, I think they do. You have to chronically tell people stop chasing after the puppy. I'm serious. You do. do anything it might lay down in a minute anyway oh hi Mike so he's already good you know I think it's very important in the beginning to seem very and they handle him a lot at this place so he kind of does jump all over me if he said do I correct that oh not at all oh not at all he's my best friend he's my best friend I just don't have any reaction it doesn't work at all I don't want to sit though, I definitely don't. He's already getting on the platform. Yeah, Claire doesn't seem to understand the ears. I like the ears cut. If they've got the big floppy, I like Great Danes with the cut ears too. Since he's all over me, I say to myself, well, maybe I'll turn him out into getting up here. Since he's all over me, maybe I'll turn him Oh, he's absolutely precious. I don't want the sit, though, so. things works and doesn't work. <laughs> so that's, a, that's what the world is, Mike. It either works or it doesn't. There's no partly works or it partly doesn't work. It either works or it doesn't. If it worked one time, it'll work again. That's how I think. So it's not working, not working. Not working. No, you little butter butt. It's not not working. I'm not hostile. I mean, there's no corrections. He almost did it. No, you little butter button. No, you little butter button. No, they probably teach them the show training. No, oh. oh, it's working already. No, no, he wouldn't eat or drink at all. I said, Jesus, pull over, get a cheeseburger or anything. So I told the guy. Possible though, you want the head up when they 
put the food on the ground. I find it very odd. You said you do drop. I do drop it sometimes. But it's not helping the dog look at the handler. If the food is always going onto the ground, if you see this. Clearly, it's helping him look on the ground. Oh, hi, Nainan. Or Nainan. So, anyway, now I can go back to the platform. He already gets up there. Oh, here comes Squash. I think you need to structure a seated handler right away. If, you say, if not, there are 90 pounds doing this to you, and you can't even sit down, and you can't ignore them because they're knocking you down. Jockeying, flipping your arms. Elliot, I mean, oh, he's a big arm flipper. And you said, oh, well, I'll just tighten up my arms. I won't let him. No, there's no tightening up your arms with him. He'll use his head like a crowbar and flip your whole arm up. He's absolutely precious, and I was just I've been very sad. And just Facebook won't let you forget about anything. That's the problem. If you said I'm going to try to forget, there's no forgetting. Not on Facebook. So I'm systemically moving away. I mean, he doesn't even know me. If you said what's anything else, I systemically move away. If he says it bad, a full food. <laughs> He's already getting up there. If you said, should you lure him? No. I think we've got to say this is maybe, you know, free agency training. I mean, because you're, if it takes more time to make it think that it wants to do it on its own, you're better off. You're understanding that that's. Just honestly, a little bit of momentum. You see these people, they can't get the dog in the car and stuff. And just get, get a little bit more room. <laughs> Almost. The crash per perfectly accepts him, though. <laughs> you see, my guy almost got him up there. I almost got him up there. Anyway, this might be my new project, and maybe I should do this for the ebook too. Uh, but you know, these are pretty trainable. So, oh, those are easy to train. They are. They're light on the leash. They're light on the leash. That's why I like them. You see how you can just dance them around. seated handler. I think right away, if you said you want the default down right away, I don't think you want the default down. Maybe the default stand. The default stand. Wait, wait at the ready. Oh, you can always get that. Ah, down later. Absolutely precious. If he said, well, he seems to be responding. Yes, that's the whole thing. This works. It's, it's responding. I haven't even had the dog for like two hours. Why, oh, Sharon, this is my new puppy. If you said, how long have you had it? Like two hours. There. No, not at all. You shouldn't lure it up there. You precious little peanut. Seated handler. 
Look, he didn't even jump on me. He didn't even jump on me. If you jump, so you can we give him room to jump on the platform. So there's my default stand. Now he's getting on the platform. Oh, he's absolutely precious. All right, guys, I'm going to go get some stuff done, and I've been very excited to get this little puppy. And I've always had Dobermans. They are easy to train. I mean, if you said that's just like a Malinois. I know, but I deserve that. And they're super, super flashy. I mean, I'm going to get that Martin collar. I can't, that was dog shirt IQ. I can't, I'm not going to buy a new one. And, you know, then it's got the constant on it. I don't even want that. Oh, you know what I could do, though, I suppose? I guess I could just get the new IQ and just put plastic contact points on it. Then it would just be a pager-only collar, right, Mike? Yeah, maybe that's what we should tell people. It doesn't have that strong of a pager, but all you got to do to make it into a pager-only collar is just put plastic contact points on it. Even one plastic contact point. Anyway, he's doing great. He's only had him for like two hours. So that's what I'm going to call him, little Yoshi. Yoshi. You said, should you just say it like that? I'm just saying it so I can see how it sounds to myself. He can't hear me with his ears. Yeah. Anyway, he's out of a champion. And he's out of all European bloodlines. So if you said they're a little bit... Yeah, they are easy to train. I mean... They, they've got a lot of go. Let's just put it that way. They like to go fast, and so it's easy to train them to go faster. But I mean, it, within this is what this dog has learned about me in 15 minutes. If I would have sat down there, we could do this whole puppy first series for the ebook. I think that's what we need to do anyway. We, we, I mean, we could we could put out something, Sharon. That was like 20 hours worth of footage. Detailing, you know, like eight different case studies of dogs that were conditioned. Two cases of puppies, two cases of young adults, two cases of psychotic monster dogs, cases of hinky older killer dogs. <laughs> and then somebody would say, you know, well, I want to do a thing to where you identify the different types of handlers because there's very specific types of handlers and people need to identify themselves as these people. Anyway, let me show you his little face. Okay, she already accepts it. That's just how they look at you. Oh, he's a proud little kitty. Anyway, that's the very first day, so... Not even the first day. He's only been here, like, two hours. So, you know, if you said he's already... Yeah, he's already, you know, figuring out what works. Let's put it that way. And I think that's what, you know, I think that's where I need to start, put a default stand on him. If he's going to have, you know, or maybe try to do a trained retrieve. Or just do it as a shaped retrieve and then do it as a trained retrieve. Anyway, what a face. Oh, what a face. You know, supposed to eat, eat, eat or drink the whole trip. And I was like, oh my God, I was freaking out. Her crash, though, she's so good. She just accepts him. She just accepts him, little ear things and all. He has to copy and get up there, too. Oh, what nice clone at her. You know, if a dog, people need to say this, if a dog wants to do something, it's almost impossible to get them to stop. So if I wanted to get on the platform, my best bet is make it to believe it wants to get on there. Then nothing I do is going to keep it off of there. Then it's going to go there no matter what. Oh, how cute are they? Oh, he is precious. So it looks like they already taught him how to sit. Yes. If you said you want that, not really. I think you should stand him up out of a set. Anyway, Sharon, maybe let's think about that because that footage is all already there. We just would have to edit it together. And we could have corresponding text. Or even you could we could take your notes and point out certain 
highlight things that they should be noticing. I'm noticing if I don't point things out, people don't notice them as easily. But once pointed out, it then becomes brutally obvious. Look at that face, that little smile. You yeah, smile. <laughs> and he's got the black toes. If you said, what's that indicative? Oh, that's the European dogs. They think those black toes. Anyway, I sent the picture to Angie Marie. Because she got a new puppy, too, and I have to babysit that one, so they'll be so cute together. It'll be a lot bigger. Anyway, guys, I will be back. But yeah, let's think about that, uh, Karen. Or I mean, Sharon. Um, <laughs> Karen. Karen, good day, ma'am. Um, you know, just the, it would be a series of case studies and say it's, you know, this is the equivalent of an online course because you're studying these, you know, You can see, I mean, where it went from point A to point B. It's not before and after. You know, there's all the in-between. So, you know, like the, we could do like two cases of fear biters. There are normal dogs. They're so just like that dog, Nilla. And there's been other puppies that just were, you know, just labs or just normal. You know, that didn't have any issues. Like two of There's like two of them. We can use those two. Oh, we can do like two deaf dogs too, and included the training of two deaf dogs. Yeah, sonar. And it would just be hours, honestly, of footage. You know, and you, we, we could say, well, it's, it's the total is, you know, 40 hours of footage. This is the equivalent of an online course. There's nothing you've ever, you know, had. You're, we suggest that you study this over, you know, not one day. <laughs> A six month period or whatever and then also try to watch the live shows and try to put it all together and you too will be able to do this anyway look he already stands up if, you, if I was a normal person the first thing I'd be doing was say sit and then I'll tell you with these they don't rub the ears if you said you have to worry that it had its ears rubbed at that kennel mm -mm, no no they don't rub the ears there anyway he's a little cutie well, yes, and the little notes of the things that you see that help you get it more. That, that's what I need. In my mind, everybody should just get it. Why don't they just get it? <laughs> but I see that it takes little pieces of different... You have to have certain... You, you have to raise people's consciousness. You know, if they truly believe that you just rub the dog on the head, that one guy couldn't keep his hands off that dog, the one where I said it was sickening... And the dog kept facing away and just rubbing its head like I've never seen. Just disgusting. All right, so he's jumping up. He started to sit, but I stopped him. Now I'm going back over to the platform. And, you know, this is the dog's first session, and this is how good it's doing. So if you said, well, what if you were doing all the wrong things? Wouldn't it be learning those real good real fast, too? That's what it seems like. That's what it seems like. I mean, this, if you said, well, you worked, worked with it, it's, it's only been here two hours. <laughs> I haven't worked with it. I just turned the camera on. He's thinking about how can I get up there. If you said, why wouldn't you? Well, you would want him to think, well, we're fine with this. If you said, what about when he gets up there? OMG. OMG. I never saw anything like it. deliberate about how I'm getting the treat though it's all no obligation the hand has got to disappear quickly and now I'm just getting the dry feed now now he's thinking well that would be unlike anything anybody's got and then we can fill in like the flow chart get the recall first if they're not starting with that I mean I didn't make that up. There's only two ways to introduce the call, motion or stationary. If you said they're all doing stationary, yeah, that's what all those people are doing. But if you said they never get to the motion part, not really, not really. I mean, you see them not moving. If you think they could suddenly say, tell them to come real fast and they would, they wouldn't. Yeah, that dog Fred is a good case study because the owner, in the beginning, was there awful and terrible handler. 
terrible owner, terrible handler. And then the dog was here for like 12 weeks. So it would be, you know, we could say this case study involves a dog that was trained over a 12 week period. You know, and honestly, you're not a serious pro, so you may need to stretch it out a little bit longer. You know, that's what people get in their mind. Oh, I can just get trained in two weeks. You know, not that I'm aware of. You know, you, people have other things going on. You're not training it all day. I mean, you are training it all day long, but not the way these people do it. But yeah, I've got a ton of puppy. We could have start out the beginning. Could be small puppies, the puppy recall. Look how much stu of that stuff I have, Sharon. Just the puppies running to the platform and, you know, the puppies, the pan and all these things without... There's no pager. So it's really not just about the e-collar. It's just about... It's about a way of training dogs. It's, it's really what it is. I mean, the pagers are part of it, but it's not... Oh, e-collar training. You know, I mean... I've got all that puppy work. The deliver to hand isn't, you know, and of course we put all that in there. This thing's gonna be, you know, Jesus, the file's gonna break the internet. Oh, hi, Joe. Anyway, you can see how just, this is this puppy's first session and it's already, if you said, well, where are you going with this? It's pretty obvious, you know, that it's gonna, if it's already getting on the platform and it's the, if he said first day, yeah, first two hours that it's here, it's already concluding. So if you said, well, what if there was no place to go to? No, it wouldn't be as good. If he said, well, my dog does that when I go out the counter by my cutting board. Oh, mine do it too. Mine do it too. That's where I got the idea. <laughs> you little big-footed cutie. Anyway, this was my Christmas present, so I'm going to go, but I'm going to be training him, and I'll tell you, that's a very, very good start. And if you said, well, you didn't rub him, you didn't talk. There's no rubbing, there's no tossing. You know, if you can't sit quietly, if you said, what if he jumps all over you? I don't correct him. I'm sure he's a total snuggle. <coughs> this doesn't work. I mean, if you want to... very odd, Mike, the way Crash has already accepted him. Yeah, Sharon, that's what I'm thinking. What if the e-book was just the case studies? Oh, no. uh -oh. Uh -oh. oh I accidentally gave it to him when he had his feet on me. He said that was bad. Oh, for sure. Oh, for sure. If you said gloss it over real quick, yeah. He said, no, no, I can think it's Crash. setting up a very successful location from day one. 
Nothing but success here. There's no corrections. Only success. Crash, tell me you didn't just, oh my God, Crash. Was that a fluke? No, it really wasn't. I've seen it before. He says it, he's always going to do it for him. There is a percentage of dogs that will do it the very first time. So precious crash. Oops. Oh yeah, he's hungry too. Just the way crash accepts him. I like she could see that. I don't know if you saw that, Mike. I was like she could see it. So the jumping on me didn't work at all, but as soon as he went to the platform, he said, anyway, I'm going to leave it with that. I got to go get stuff done, but very, very exciting. And I'm going to start training him every day. And he will be a, another case study that we can use for the ebook. Let's think about that though, Sean, because we could put that together. Oh, the footage is already there. It would have to be edited somewhat, you know, if I was just babbling on with one of my ridiculous stories. It's not that hard to do though, to trim it. And then it should be all chronologically uploaded. I mean, some of it might be peppered in later dates, but the initial cases would be chronologically uploaded so it wouldn't be like we wouldn't know what you know order they were in because i used to keep a really that dog ollie is a good case well there's a lot of them that black german shepherd axel that hinky german shepherd layla yeah there's quite a few of them well we could you know if we could pick if we could narrow it down to like a dozen cases I know that sounds like a lot.